The hiring of a new interim secretary also stirring up controversy. KRK4 Samantha Boyd got her hands on a letter that advises against Eddie Joe Williams taking on the new position. Samantha, walk us through this letter and who's it from? Him? Yeah, Laura, well, I requested and obtained this letter from Attorney General Tim Griffin that's telling former State Senator Eddie Joe Williams that the appointing of him from the board was illegal and is rather the governor's job to do appointments. At the bottom of the letter, it also says that they were giving uh, Williams up until 3 o'clock today to either accept or deny the job. And as of the last few hours, the AG's office said that they had not heard back from him. But I reached out to the board's spokesperson asking if Williams had accepted the job or not and she says he accepted it back at the board meeting earlier in the week that I covered for you guys. The spokesperson argues that this was well within their authority because Williams is considered an executive officer during this period not an actual secretary. Just as a reminder this is all happening in the first place because former secretary Joe Perfiri was fired after a judge ruled in the board's favor over a law a few weeks ago allowing his job status to be in their hands. The attorney general is appealing that ruling and trying to give the authority back to the governor. But in the meantime, it's up to the board. We'll have more on this coming up tonight at six. But it's also worth noting that in that letter, the attorney general says he can and will take legal action depending on their response from Williams. And again, they say they have not heard back from Williams. And the spokesperson for the board says Williams has accepted that job. So now the AG is saying he is, quote, considering all options. Of course, we'll continue to follow that and keep you guys posted. Reporting live from the Capitol, Samantha Boyd, Care K, 4 News.